Hey Jules, welcome to my channel. Thank you so much for stopping by today. In today's video, I'm going to be doing a plan with me. I feel like I haven't done a plan with me on my channel in a while. So I'm excited to be doing a plan with me today. If you are new here, thank you so much for stopping by and I hope that you like this video and I hope that you consider subscribing to my channel. If you are returning Jewel, thank you so much for coming back. Um, like I said, in today's video, I will be doing a plan with me. Um, I recently, you guys got a new A5 planner. I am in love. She is not all set up, but here she is. She is a beauty. And once I get her all set up, I will be sure to do a flip through video here on my channel, but I am trying to gather some inserts. I'm still waiting on some things to come into the mail. So I'm super excited about getting her um, all done up. Haven't named her yet, but I'm super excited about getting her all done up. So this week I will be planning for the week of October 26th through November 1st. I can't believe that 2020 has like come and gone. Even through all the things that went on through this year, can't believe we're almost down to the end of the year. So what I'm going to be using today is, um, even though it's fall, I'm feeling a little pinkish. It is one of my favorite colors, so why not? Um, I am going to be using this I guess it's like um, some diamonds in different kind of shapes um, and gold, but there is pink here for the washi. And then I am also going to be using this plain washi here, okay? And then as far as stickers this week, I was kind of trying to look through some of my books. I am going to be using um, the Capital Chic's design book here. And then I am also going to be using some Gold Mine and Cocoa um, stickers which I store in this little booklet here. So without further ado, let me get into how I am going to plan out for the week and I will come back at the end. See you guys in a moment.
All right, you guys. So here is my spread for this week. Um, I love how the colors came out together. I started off with a lighter pink for the washi, but when I was looking at the stickers that I wanted to use, it's more of a darker pink, almost um, a reddish like maroon color. So I kind of like the way the colors contrast and I ended up using more colors or more stickers from that same like spreadsheet that was together um, of stickers or it was like a theme set together. And um, then I ended up using my gold mine and Coco, just that little bitty doll. She has an LV inspired or LV dress on and purse. And I think that's super, super cute. Um, I did not have all of my functional stickers with me as I was planning um, or as I was filming. So I will have to go back and put those things in. But I am pleased with how my spread came out for the week. You guys, as I kind of go further in my planner journey, I am becoming more minimalistic in how I decorate my planner. I still love my washi tape. I still love my stickers. However, I just don't do all the things anymore when I plan. So I like to say very minimalistic, even though this probably is not minimal to some people, um, but it's minimal, more minimal for me. And then I am uh, usually a, a mix between minimal and functional if you've been following um, my channel at any length. So as I said, I am so pleased with how my spread came out. I realized that my washi tape, some of the diamonds, the diamonds are upside down, but I wasn't going to start taking it off. Um, but I think these colors look great together. I am a firm believer, and I was watching um, At Home with Kita the other day, and she talks about in her video, um, you want it makes you want to use things if they are aesthetically pleasing. And I do feel like that is so, so true. So I do like for my planner to look pretty. Uh, but at the same time, I just don't do all the things in my planner as well. So I hope you guys are having a great week so far. And one thing I wanted to tell you guys, when I was putting my washi down, I kind of felt like I watched some of the makeup guru um, videos and they always do their eyebrows off camera. And I almost thought I should have just did my washi off camera because I felt like I was struggling with the washi tonight. So I wanted to just share that thought with you guys. But Nevertheless, let me stop rambling and get on um, with this video. I hope you guys enjoyed seeing what I came up with for this week. Um, and stay tuned for another video this week as well. I am going to try to get a second video out this week. Um, so stay tuned for that. Again, if you have not already subscribed to my channel, please go ahead and subscribe to this channel and also share my video with your planner friends. I'm looking to meet new planner friends and get inspiration and we can share and help each other out as well. So until the next video, you guys have a blessed day and I will talk to you later. Bye.